talk with Jal much? Oh, yeah. Traded swear words. Really? That's what you asked him about? A completely different tech base, and you start there. You want to talk shop? Talk shop. I want to know him. Ah. You know, there was a time when Sid was afraid of space. We were traveling a lot, and one day she just woke up and realized there was nothing outside the shuttle walls. Happened more than once. She'd panic. I'd hold her for as long as it took. She doesn't even remember now. It was only for a month or two. Funny, huh? The things they don't remember. And you feel like it's up to you to hold on to it, or else it's just gone. And there's just something there that you know you're missing. Drac? Just hold on to it. How are those jokes coming, Sam? What is green with red toenails? No idea. What is green with red toenails, Sam? A Krogan masquerading as a cherry tree. Uh... Tracking a remnant architect. The one we fought ended up in orbit? Amazing. Anomaly detected. Probes launched. Anomaly found. Turian friend on Eos has good instincts. Let's check it out. Anomaly detected. Probes launched. Anomaly found. Possible cat supplies, just like Dark had suggested. Anomaly on sensors. Deploying probe. Getting a scan. Severe damage consistent with easel detonation. Oh, I get it. Turian escape vector, right? Another of their tricks, dumping fuel as last ditch mines. Our shuttle might still be out there. I'm picking up something. Deploying probe. Getting a scan. It's dark, but no, I'm getting low readings. 
Stasis fields. Priority to the Nexus. We have a shuttle for retrieval with Site 2 survivors. Resilience, you are coming home. May I assist? Why do some colonists have a number letter designation? All initiative members do. In the CV file somewhere, anyway. It isn't relevant when everyone is doing everything. I suppose it's like uh, caring about a middle name. Do you not know yours? I wasn't aware I had one. Hmm. You were in select company even before you were made Pathfinder. Scott Rider Pathfinder. Specialist designation, A04 Malapa. Hmm. Something interesting? An A and low odds. Hmm. Someone's an early adopter. I have a specific person I want brought out of Cryo. Name and designation if available. I heard that the chief engineer on EOS went back into cryo. There have been a few such requests. The first few months in Helios were... disheartening. Now the Prodromos is on track. I want her redeployed. Chief Engineer Grace Lito, designation E-97 Durango. Deployment will begin shortly. Is there anything else, Pathfinder? Another time. Pathfinder. Apex personnel, please check your duty roster for... You're listening to h &S, your source for news in Helios, an independent arm of the Andromeda Initiative. Ryder, one of your father's memories is available. Let's see it. This memory is from when your parents returned to Earth, after your mother was diagnosed with her disease. It's simple. We take Sam. Who? I named the AI. Simulated adaptive matrix. Sam, we use your research and interface Sam with an implant. Um, my work on biotic implants was yielding results, but this, I don't know. What did the doctor say? Alec. What did he say? It's getting worse. There's your answer. This will work. Sam can fix you. Alec, I'm not some war you have to win. You're not an N7 anymore. That doesn't mean we- They kicked you out of the Alliance for this. We're talking about your life. Alec, did you ever consider that maybe it's my time to go? I'm human. We die. It happens. Ellen, please. Losing you is not an option. The kids aren't gonna lose their mother. God knows they never had a father. Then give them one. They just asked for a refund. So can this Sam talk yet? Hello, Ellen. Why did the tree go to the dentist? Um... To get a root canal. <laughs> Humor algorithms. I can't seem to get the hang of it. Or maybe it's the guy teaching them? That felt so real. Mom was right there. Alive. It was the first time I met Ellen. My education on human mortality began that day. Your mother seemed prepared to die. But Dad wasn't ready. Mom was just trying to prepare him. Even though all human beings one day expire. Yeah, but when it's someone you love, it's not that cut and dry. I'm beginning to understand where your father's resolve came from. Private audio logs are now available in your father's quarters. I detect additional memories, but they are currently locked. 
they may yet hold answers. Okay, I'll keep working on it. That's all for now. Of course. Your father's personal logs. Give me that, Alec. We've heard enough of you talking. Right. So, here's the irony. My research on biotic implants and ESO caused this stupid disease. But maybe it'll save me, too. No maybe about it. Hey, this is my secret log. Anyway, the right type of implant joined with the right type of AI could actually bolster human physiology. Even as the disease is trying to kill me, the implant and Sam are counteracting it, keeping things balanced. Result? I get to hang around a little longer. Maybe collect on all those anniversary dinners this guy owes me. As a Quarian and historian, how do you view your people's reaction to the Geth? Well, we banned artificial intelligence, which was understandable, but that was digging a hammer to a rather delicate nail. Which was what? The very thing that sparked the revolt. The first Geth who asked us, Creator, does this unit have a soul? But how could it have a soul? Geth had no meaningful perceptions of the world or diversity of experiences we take for granted. Worse, the Geth saw us as the Creator. The revolt was inevitable. We were their superiors. And they resented it. Ryder, Barlapon says you're looking for me. It's not every day an XN7 looks for the Shadow Broker. Anything can be had, provided you can pay. Especially when the tech involves artificial intelligence. The Council will have specters all over my ass if they catch wind of this. Translation, I'll get you the code you want, but the price just doubled. If you try to renege, I've got people. People with guns. system. It's almost lost in a scourge. What else could be lost out there? on sensors. Deploying probe. I found something.
Sending the nav point for Darpalev. That's where the Moshe's team should be. It used to be an Angaran town. There'll be landing pads and good sight lines for a safe approach. Anomaly on the sensors. Something big, possibly hostile, taking evasive action. Wait, I don't think his... Something you don't see back home. Bringing us in. The vault must be fully operational here. It is beautiful. But the wilds can also be deadly. None of these readings show any change. How could there not be a change? Jarl, what are you doing here, in the company of these people? Kiran, this is Pathfinder Ryder, from a long way away. Ryder, Kiran Dals, lead scientist at Darpanev. I just have to say, Havarl is beautiful. The planet's beauty is the least of my current concerns. Where's the rest of the team? Ryder has experience with Remnant. We might be able to help their investigations. You haven't heard? While the team was exploring the monolith, something went terribly wrong. They were caught in some kind of Remnant stasis field, frozen in place, unresponsive. I know how to work Remnant tech. I can help you. Ryder has seen a vault, and apparently reset it. Somehow. Ocean of fish, one will have gems in its mouth. But if you think the alien can help, I'll set skepticism aside. The monolith is not far from here. See what you can do, but be careful. We don't know what triggered the stasis, and it may happen again. What is it? Tell me more about the stasis that's taken out your team. We don't know what started it, and it's the first time any of us have heard of something like this happening. The team sent out there studied monoliths before. At least half of them worked with Moshai Sefer. They were just doing their job when the stasis hit. Now it's like they're frozen in time. Nothing will wake them. Stimulants, loud noises. They show no reaction to sensation or pain. 
Jarl said you worked for the Moshai? Not I, but many of the team that was sent to the Monolith are her students. If we can't save her people, I don't think I could ever face her again. We'll find a way to help them, Kiran. I promise. I should get going. Be careful. I heard the advisory that you'd be out here. It didn't prepare me to meet you. The name's Ryder. I'm with the Andromeda Initiative. They say you want to help us. I wonder what you're prepared to do. If it gets me on your good side, I'm in. That's reassuring, assuming you mean well. My name is Rochelle Veer. I'm an archaeastronomer. I study our ancient cultural records for stellar phenomena. I piece together lost knowledge of ages past. My goal is to find undiscovered colonies we lost contact with, potential allies against the Ket. You think there might be Angara worlds you don't know about? That's what I was trying to learn. Then this happened. I was away when the disaster struck. I thought my home was destroyed, and all my research with it, but I just learned part of the building survived. I'm trying to recover my research data, but the wildlife won't let me near my old home. These house guests, I assume they're of the hungry variety? The structure has become a breeding ground for insects and predators. Too many to face alone. Your work is too important to lose. Let's get it back. I'll provide my home's location. Just recover my research materials from the computer. I'll remain in contact with you by comm. Thank you for this. My hopes rest with you. Please, help me recover my research. available. Emergency support from cat attacks. All of them. Oh man, my lord. What's he doing here? What? Is everything all right? You seem distressed. Uh, would you like a reward for that astute observation? <sighs> You're that alien visitor that came to Aya asking about our vault. You've heard of me. Who hasn't? When strange new species turn up, reports spread fast. After the Ket, can't be too careful. Luge Anson, historian with the repository of history, Aya. Listen, if there's nothing you need, could you go away? I'm busy trying to get transport off this cursed planet. Why did you come here from Aya? Kieran's team found some remnant relics while digging around the old ruins. I was sent to collect them for the repository. 
It shouldn't have taken more than a day. But things never go according to schedule, do they? You don't seem to like Havarl very much. Havarl's other regions suit me just fine. But here... Oh no. I don't do well in this fierce wilderness. <clears throat> you think these shelters keep you safe? They don't. Woke up this morning and found a thorny vine wormed its way into my bunk. I'm stranded here because a branch pierced my shuttle's power core. You mentioned remnant ruins. Are there lots of remnant here? Yes. If you've been out in the jungle, you might have seen some of it. We think the ruins were part of a vast remnant complex. We've seen evidence of hallways that wound through the area both above and below the ground. Generations ago, our people took shelter in what we found here. That's how Palef was established. Were there no hostile remnant machines? None, according to the histories. We found artifacts, of course. Bits of things that we could study. But they say it was like moving into an empty home. I won't bother you further. Very well. Watch out for plants while you're out there. Vicious things. Activating automated forward station deployment. Pathfinder, this is Rochelle V. You're approaching the remains of my home. I've detected multiple life forms in the area. Their movements appear agitated. I think we stirred up a nest. Damaged. Let's see if we can recover anything from it. Nice shot! Pathfinder, the computer's data core is damaged beyond repair. Rochelle, it's Ryder. We're inside your old home, but your research data didn't survive. All your effort and risk for nothing. I'm sorry. The risk was worth it. We just got unlucky. Years of my life gone. You didn't have backups? Of course, but they went down with the city's network memory center. That site is now buried underground. Even if you could find an access point on the surface, the odds of recovering anything are remote. All I heard is there's a chance. Let's go for it. That didn't fully translate, but I know optimism when I hear it. I can point you in the general direction of where the network memory center used to be. You'll have to hunt for an exposed network node. I'll stand by. Thank you, Pathfinder. Pathfinder, I've detected energy readings consistent with an active network node. Is it on the surface? We'll find out.
Network connection is established. I'm logging in. Searching. I found them. Research files downloading. And done. You did it. We did it. Go team. If we recovered this data, we may be able to access everything lost in the disaster. I'll alert my colleagues. You've accomplished something amazing, Pathfinder. Watch out for Rokar. And Garen fanatics that hate aliens. That means you. Charming. Activating automated forward station deployment. You get any fungal slime on your skin, I suggest you wash it off immediately. Let's be careful around the native flora, okay, everyone? Okay, I've never described a mushroom as pretty, but those are. Found them. The researchers caught in the stasis field. Exactly where Kieran said they would be. to do it.
meeting of the monitors and... Scat! Scatting stars! What? Who are you? How did... Thanks isn't necessary. Just doing my job. More aliens? Out of nowhere? A and Jal? Do none of you remember getting frozen? Frozen? I don't understand. We were just working on the monolith and then... And then you appeared. You should return to Palev. Kieran will want to speak to you. Maybe you're right. Oh, I feel a head splitter coming on. We should make sure they return to the station. Who knows what lingering effects they might suffer from. This Sam of yours in your head, how is it allowing you to interface with the Remnant? Sam helps with analysis and translation, among other things. It's complicated. Pathfinder, my senses read an Andromeda plant sample nearby. Sam, another memory trigger? Yes, though my memory array remains locked. Additional triggers are required. to the gut. Painful. I appreciate the help back there. Name's Avidus Ricks. Sorry if my methods seem extreme. Civilian life is... trying. Scott Ryder, human pathfinder. You former military? A Spectre. Special tactics and reconnaissance. Did the Council's dirty work for 15 years. So you're used to being above the law. Well, good thing there are no laws in Andromeda, huh? The initiative was my retirement plan. Then Natanis hit the scourge and bam, woke up here. What happened? 
Where's the Ark? No idea. Had to break out of my own damn stasis pod. A fall like that should have killed you. Those pods are sturdier than they look. But most of the Turian population is still missing. Including Mason, our Pathfinder. Sam hasn't transferred to me, so he's alive. Just don't know where. He hasn't made it back to the Nexus. Knowing Mason, he's out there looking for me. Mason dedicated his life to Andromeda. He's too stubborn to die now. We need every Pathfinder we can get. The debris and stasis pods from the Tannis are scattered across the sector. Between the two of us, we should find something. You go left, I go right? <laughs> something like that. Here's my frequency. Call when you find something. I can't believe this is really happening. Thought we'd be stuck here forever, or until the aliens killed us. We built this camp from what remained of our stasis pod. If we leave, we can't abandon our wreckage. There's debris we couldn't get to out there. We have to take it with us. Anything from the crash belongs to the initiative. It'll go back to the Nexus with you. Good. No telling what's still intact. Don't want hostile aliens using it against us. If you find anything from Ark Natanis, tag it for recovery. Oh, and thank you. Pathfinder? Do the Rokar attack often? Only when they find us. Bad as they are, damn plants are the bigger danger. I keep telling the others not to eat anything raw, but when you're starving, logic's the first thing to go. How are the other survivors holding up? They're in shock. Too busy surviving to grieve or take stock of what's happened. But when things eventually do calm down, it'll hit them. And it won't be pretty. You must have some great stories from your Spectre days. <laughs> Not that I can tell. That's kind of the point of classified ops. Surely you can bend the rules after 600 years. Bending the rules? Yeah, that's what I thought being a Spectre was all about. Saren Arterius himself recommended me to the Council. Whatever their command, I carried it out without question. Saren? The rogue Spectre who led the Geth attack on the Citadel? If you believe the rumors, the Saren I knew was ruthless. Not crazy. But something made him snap. Everyone has a breaking point. I got out before I hit mine. Mason convinced me Andromeda was my chance to live outside the shadows. That's why I'm here. Are you and Mason close? We know each other well, yes. Did I say something wrong? No, sorry. Uh, I'm just not used to discussing my personal life. Take care, Avidus. Likewise, Ryder. <sighs> Arknatanis debris, tagged for salvage. Kieran Dahl said something about fish and gems to me. What was that all about? In an ocean of fish, one will have gems in its mouth. Meaning your success with Remnant is probability, not skill. As the number of cases approaches infinity, the unlikeliest outcomes become likely. Oh. Thought it might have been something like that. Ark Natalis debris, tagged for salvage. Ark Natalis debris, tagged for salvage. Ark 
park the Tannis debris, tagged for salvage. Ark Natalis debris, tagged for salvage. You don't feel any different? I don't think so. Why? Do you? My mind feels clouded, but I don't know if I'm just tired. You weren't lying. Kira had told us everything. She even had pictures. I apologize for the indifferent welcome you received from me earlier. After everything you've faced, I wouldn't have blamed you if you shot at me. <laughs> We're all glad that didn't happen. Ryder, what you have done here, your remnant understanding, and your Sam should convince Ephra you're an asset. We should speak to him as soon as we can. Perhaps on the Tempest? Kieran, I've been thinking, if Ryder can use remnants, couldn't we fix the monoliths? Stop Haval's decline? Haval's decline? This will take time to explain. We can discuss it further when you have time. <laughs> 